Hi everyone, hope you're doing well. Today I wanted to make a video for you guys for how to properly measure or weigh your flour. Uh, last week we did a video uh, comparing the different methods of flouring measuring and how they stack up and therefore affect the amount of flour in your recipe. And today I wanted to go over exactly how to weigh your flour the most accurate way so you can have the best results. So starting off here, um, we only have a few uh, things to demonstrate this. You want a bowl, you want your kitchen scale. Once again, these are only like 10 bucks on Amazon. I have this brand, I love it. It's Ectec City or whatever. Um, and then we have flour and just a big spoon. So what we wanna do to start, I always like to put my bowl on my scale at the beginning um, and then we'll turn it on. Putting the bowl on here will basically account for the weight of the bowl when you're measuring. Um, so that way you're not getting that weight, you're just getting the weight of the flour. If, let's say, you start your scale up without it, and you put your bowl on there, you'll see here, we just, we're at, right now we're getting the weight of the bowl. All you wanna do there is re-zero your scale. Um, you'll probably need to look up how your particular scale, um, which button's best, but we'll just re-zero that there so we get to see that it's zero grams. And then from here, um, in order to measure, it's a little weird when I twist it. Um, all you'll need to do is just simply scoop your flour in to get the weight you want. Um, keeping in mind that one cup equals 120 grams. So I'll just measure out a cup today. So you'll see here, so I keep on watching it. Oops. Okay, I'm at 122, remove two grams. And then you can see here, it will show the weight. So there, and then you're all set. And if you ever have a recipe that says, you know, two cups or two and a half cups or whatever, you just multiply two or two and a half by 120 grams, and you'll get the amount of flour that you need to measure out. All right, thanks so much for listening. Have a great day.